Hello YouTube, Merry Christmas. It is Christmas Eve and I'm doing a Christmas Eve video. I haven't done a video for quite some time as I've been busy with work and problems with uploading videos to the internet. So here's what we've got. We've got the Ewer Real Trail. I already did a video on that, I think, quite some time ago. And I've got my big black Sans3 speakers. I'm not sure what model they are. I can move out of the light here. And I just built that shelf a couple of days ago for this reel to reel. And that's the other speaker with homemade antenna for the TV. And that's dr driven with that little amplifier. It's a, uh, what is it called? Not La Pie, I don't think. It's a Tally or something like that. T L I or something. <laughs> same, pretty much the same amplifier uh, Max Arcade uses. So that real to real died. I think. I think it's clutch driven or something. Because if I go fast forward. Real table just doesn't move at all. This one's not moving. It's either clutch died or something. It was when I found it, I played for some time. When I found it, I had found that the tape had snarled and was wrapped around the cap stand. This is what's left of the supply reel of tape. This little reel here. That was uh, the amount after the snarl. And that's it was all wrapped up on the capstan. <clears throat> and that just pretty much fell apart at that spot right there. So I've got to splice this lot back together if it's worth it. Stupid Sony tape has the uh, sticky shed, almost like a sticky shed syndrome type of thing. It's, it's the oxide coming off. Anyway, I bought this reel to reel about uh, two years ago. Wanted to completely restore it. Didn't replace the belt kit, but replaced some tubes. I've got the original head cover someplace, haven't found it, but this is another voice music head cover I have. <coughs> so, uh, I've got it paused. It's a little noisy. It's just the internal speaker. Press that button, can't leave it up. I don't know 
of works. This little part doesn't. Alcohol. That is an automatic stop, but uh, it doesn't actually depress that. It just turns off the machine. That's a recording monitor. I'll switch. Throw it back through here. See if it's on side one. If this was a tape I had got with a real drill, or if it was a port. crack in the plastic here. They always get that. This little latch, you have to bring it up and slide it over. Uh, that's for record mode. You have to hit those same time, those two buttons, and slide that over. Clunky drive reel to reel. <laughs> Controlling everything with these. No logic, nothing. One motor. It's actually pretty good for a single motor, real to real. splice that tape back together figure out what happened with it but uh, that'll go up on the repair bench probably in a month or two I just got the Dynavox yesterday so that's next in priority uh, business is really priority over anything so it take a while for that to get fixed turn this machine off not that one it's so I can leave that set this one. So, thanks for watching. Merry Christmas.